Number two, our development partners, Bosch Motorsport. So being the largest automotive supplier in the world, there are a lot of products out there with the Bosch name on it, <clears throat> and quite often that's what comes to mind when you mention Bosch. People think spark plugs, uh, lambda sensors, map sensors, fuel pumps, you know, you name it, on and on and on and on and on. But uh, there's a lot more coming out of that company, particularly the motorsport division. Uh, Bosch has been involved in motorsport since 1901 with their first win with Mercedes, with their Magneto system. Um, they've been at the forefront of motorsport technology since then, and uh, they make everything from, you know, fuel injectors and alternators for NASCAR, uh, <coughs> fuel pumps, and, you know, who knows what else for Formula One. There's probably not a lot of uh, a chatter about who makes what in Formula One. Um, engine control units and ABS units in all forms of racing uh, throughout the world. And pretty much whenever there's an advancement at the highest level of motorsports, uh, Bosch Motorsport is involved, even though quite often it's behind the scenes. And uh, the most recent example that comes to mind is Audi's dominance at Le Mans with their uh, diesel-powered LMP car. Uh, there's a lot of Bosch parts in that car and a lot of Bosch engineers wandering around that car in the pits. And um, they are the absolute pinnacle of motorsport technology. And so when we say that uh, uh, we've developed these pieces uh, in partnership with Bosch Motorsport, we're very proud of that uh, for two reasons. One is that we're proud that they would accept us and work with us. Uh, we feel that that says something about our capabilities. And the other reason is that it offers us a level of technology that we couldn't develop on our own, and we can then make that available to you. And so no matter how I look at that, uh, I'm always happy to say it. I'm always happy to have the logo on my shirt. I'm always happy to have the Bosch engineer in our booth at the PRI show to answer any questions that you guys may have. And, um, you know, I could go on about these guys for an awful long time, but you don't want to hear that. Uh, well, maybe you do. I'll do another video someday. Uh, that's it. Let's get on to number three.